Hi guys, and welcome to Classic Rock and Country Music Facts and Trivia. Appreciate you being here. Um, please subscribe if you have not yet. Thank you. I had a feeling there wouldn't be very many views on the Ernest Tubb thing, but I just had to give it a shot. See what we got, where we got. So we're going on to the opposite direction again with um, some five recent facts about rocker Peter Frampton. Let's take a look. Peter Frampton was diagnosed uh, with degenerative muscle disease. Going upstairs and downstairs is the hardest thing for me, Frampton, 68, told CBS Mason. I'm going to have to get a cane, and then the other thing I noticed, I can't put things up over my head. Frampton was diagnosed with the incurable disease after a fall on stage in 2016. In 2017, he was involved in a show incident. Frampton argued with the cameraman after seeing him focusing on a fan, Sherry Tupa, who was in the crowd during the show, uh, rather than on the stage. Frampton later apologized after storming off to cut the show by saying he felt we had completely lost control of the special moment in the show. Uh, he, his farewell tour after being diagnosed with incurable rare disease, unlike other artists who say farewell tour can't be taken seriously, Frampton means what he meant uh, when it comes to farewell tour. Uh, he toured with Steve Miller in 2018. Both Miller and Frampton together conducted a 10-week, 40-date tour of North America. Music as the hero. It moves back and forth between the past and the future. Uh, Miller said in a press release, I'm very excited to announce that 2018 is our 50th anniversary of recording and touring together as Steve Miller Band. And we want to travel between the psychedelic 60s to the future with a vengeance. In 2016, Peter Frampton toured with Leonard Skinner. Leonard Skinner and Peter Frampton conducted a co-headlining summer tour with a stop at Jones Beach last 2016. The Rock Giants summer tour saw them play 12 joint shows together. I was never a huge fan of Peter Frampton. Liked his music. I never a huge fan, but I always thought it was kind of cool that uh, he's from Cincinnati, Ohio, and lives just right up the road from me. That's pretty neat. I was just hop, skipping, and jump over the pond over the Ohio River. Uh, that's all I have for you. Hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope this one gets more views than old Ernest Tubb did. <laughs> I had to try. Uh, that's all I have for you. Please subscribe. Have a great day. God bless you, and I'll be praying for you.